going on, bro? What's going on, man? We got the EQ glitch pattern on the 9317 EQ supports. Boost. Boosy boost. Boost boost. Colorway with the block and the black and white, baby. I've been shopping for you. I've been shopping for you. Saturday online, and I thought it was going to sell out. And once again, the 9317 did not sell out. Now, the first two that I seen, they sold out the white one, which on the side there had. The, the black stripe there because it was white it popped more on this glitch one they decided just to go with the same color black stripe so you don't really see it there but it's really black stripes there and then the same thing with the pink one they decided to go with the colors so they didn't do it like a different color from this to make it really really stand out but you see it more on the pink than on the black, but then again, maybe don't. You know, they go outside, it's gonna look different. I like the funky way how they do the boost on the uh, 9317. I also like the way how EQ uh, put the three stripes right here inside the midsole. They got the, uh, their padding like web like rubber. Right here, they just leave it open. I don't know why they just don't put it like the, the torso system there. But, uh, you know, just in, so that won't, you know, if you step on that, it won't puncture it. That'll probably be more smarter to cover that up. You probably gotta ask them why they don't do it. Like, why I don't do that shit? Why I just don't put the goddamn thing cover goddamn it? So what the hell you got it like that for, goddamn it? What that, the, 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 why you got it like that, man? Come on. Come on, Joe. Come on, man. Which one of y'all said that? Come on, Rick. It's you, wasn't you, Rick? You came up with that bright ass idea. This is material. Material. Some textile material. Then this part here is supposed to be the suede. Some suede. Probably some B class suede. You know? Good thing I don't got that powder shit on the suede that I don't be liking. You see the TPU uh, lacing system connected to the hill cage in the back TPU. That's this. This look more like another material instead of plastic. You usually use plastic. This is the plastic. And this is more like the material. And on the mid, on the medial, it's looking black. And then on the lateral, okay, both looking thing. Okay, I was thinking it looked different. On this one, looking black too. That's how it is on the lateral or on the medial. And that's how it looks on the lateral. And if I confuse myself, hey, if I confuse you, fuck it. You know how I go. Mistakes sometimes. EQ. And this is what they call that the glitch pattern. This is pixelated uh, net. This is not prime net. This is pixelated net. So that's the type of material you use, pixelated. Now, like I said, I like the way they do the boots, how they construct it and make it like that. I like that. How they put the little cuff down and all that. I like that. So that part I like. I'll just cover up that bottom right there. I would like leather on here. That's my personal opinion. I would like leather. I like leather. So nice, good leather. Would look nice to me. Black one and white. See how it is over here. See how that go. Get some regular material. Textile material again. Pixelated. White and black. Look like cookies and cream. See how I got the nice little sheen look right here. That look nice. Look like that's a nice little cushion. So that sounds good. Got some good cushion right here. That sheen look. So I like that. The 
just saying the size on the inside of the tongue for Vietnam made. So this one was made in Vietnam. But uh, I don't know what Vietnam they made because uh, to me, uh, China's be getting these also, man. <laughs> China be getting their hands on it, so. I don't know if he making some in Vietnam and some in China. I don't know. I'm starting to think that China are not even getting it, uh, copying it no more. They actually getting it from the same factory <laughs> that the stores with um, the companies are getting from Adidas and Nike and Jordan. Them. I think they're getting it from their factory. I think that's what they call a 97%. It's really real. That's why they don't like to go down on prices. So. I tell y'all, man, boycott the fake stuff. Boycott them. You know what I mean? At least when we buy from here, you're helping out people with their jobs. Yeah, this Getty's on sale. If it's not high beast, you can get it on sale. If you got the money, you just buy it now. If you, or you just have to have it. You know, scrape up all your pennies. Yeah, it's supposed to be suede too right here. I like how that look on the black side. It really pops out nice on the pink right there, so that look nice. I like the way it pop out. Nice strings, just regular old strings. Looking cool. And then they got the thing in their pink color. Just some old textile material. One thing about 9317s, they also be saying they 9117. So that's like confusing with Dita. I don't know why they do that. They go by 9117s and 9317s up on there. I don't know why they do that. So even inside, it says 9117. But they call these 9317. So I don't know why they call both. That's like kind of confusing. I don't know why they do it like that. You got to ask them. That's their creation. But I like it, though. This one, the, the other one that didn't sell out, which was all black, but they call that um, with the mill, black mill, up on there, that brown mill part. I didn't really like it. It looked too plain. That's why it, so, so it didn't sell out. I was able to get those to try to, uh, you know, put it on the resale thing, but it didn't do good, so I took it back. So I look in the back. But overall, pixelated knit, glitch um, design, suede on the on the side, on the midsole. I mean, on the uh, medial on the lateral, pink on this one on the lateral. And on the medium black, and on this one, it's black on this side, and on the other side, it's black also. On the medial side, it says equipment, and on the lateral side, it doesn't say that. Just have the lacing system. And you see how they got the string lacing system, and how they do the lane. All right. Now, this is on the raffle. I'm about to try to get out of here real quick. These are on the raffle, and it's going to be $10. And these are size 10 and a half. 10 and a half, $10 for the both of them. I would like to try to do this real quick because I, I don't, I'm don't. i on the fence of what I'm going to do with keeping it or not. And you don't. You only got 14 days with this policy here, I think. So let's try to get this real quick. $10. Let's join now. Just go to googlewallet.com. Google has a system called Google Wallet. And Google Wallet, you can send money, collect money, and all that stuff. So if you want, you can also get the app and all that. They legit. You get with them. You go on there. My account, you say send money. My account is goldenheart37aol.com. So that's goldenheart 37aol.com and you send that $10 there you say I'm going for the EQ glitch pack up on the notes and then also on the notes you write uh, the alias thing that you want in the drawing when these things get fulfilled which is the amount that's paid for here so we need 42 entries $10 is the entry $10 entry that's how you get in so we need 42 entries. You can play as many entries you want. 42 entries we need to get this started into somebody's house. I shake it up that day. Whoever name I pull out the bag is the winner. That's when you're going to need 
uh, a real name for that shipping because I got one to um, go to the post office or to UPS and tell them it has to be a signed delivery or FedEx or whatever way I use that they have to sign it. So you have to have ID. All right. But for the raffle itself, you can just use an alias and you go to googlewallet.com so you're safe. All right. Size 10 and a half for these puppies. And let's try to get rid of them since they didn't sell out so I can even grab more for other people, different sizes. You tell me what other sizes y'all want. Anybody who size this is not and you're just looking at it, I ask you to put down 50 cent or a dollar donation and just write on the notes, donation. And I'm always keep that to the side and, you know, to try to help the raffle succeed. So just say for this one, I have 42, 40 players and I needed that too. And I didn't want to wait no more for the people. And I had $20 inside from the donations. I'll put it to this. So that's where them donations are going to come go, go to. All right. Thank you for listening. This is Mr. Raffle. Try to help me out. I'm poor. I don't have no money. And it's getting worse now. So help me out. Like I said, I pawned my jewelry. And soon I'm going to have to take it out this month, 23rd. So it's going to be less money in, in these pots. So let's try to get this off my hands. These were um, nearly $400. One night, it was 180 And then with uh, tax, $15 each. So it was 195 each. This is where they came from. You see that day? That's the eighth. That was on a Saturday. You see what they were? That's the black ones. 180. They messed up on this side right here. <laughs> kind of ghettoish. They messed up on that side where they don't show the rest of the thing. There was, if you can see, you could make out 19 at total. It was 195. So it was 180 plus tax right there. It's greedy ass Uncle Sam, which they don't help you to get the money. Well, they sure damn well will go in your pockets and take some of your money. You know, that's that. And then this is the other receipt. You can see where it says pink. Villa. You see the date. And you see the, quant the quantity I may have got. You see the size. And that's it. That's the difference between Mr. Raffle. I'm going to get you real shit. Besides getting you real shit, I get you the real receipt. And if you do have to call them or you do want to call them, I'll tell you what to say so you don't throw me under the bus. That's how Mr. Raffle does it. And it usually be an up-to-date one unless it's one of the ones that I kept from before and I'm trying to get rid of it because I don't want it. Hey, right? Just like it says, Bounty, thank you for dealing with it. I say thank you, too. On that note, thank you for rocking out with Mr. Raffle. Big me up. Get me big. That's the same way I'm always holding down for y'all. Yeah, it's like, that's all I understand. It's like, really, you don't know what happened to it. All right, man, I'm getting ready to get out of here. Peace.